Thanks for logging into two minutes or less with Travis. So, conversation we had in the office this week, I want to tell you about. And remember, I already said somebody probably will not like this, and that's okay. Need to address this. Adisa, Rosalind, and Ashley, they say that this must be my signature move. I just do that because my hair gets in my face. I don't do it on purpose. Anyway, in the office, we were talking about what our children or our boys should bring home when they're dating or fall in love and do things like that. So we had our list of what not to and what to. And here's some of that conversation. Number one, I want her to know Jesus. Number two, I don't have weight, height, any of those restrictions. Nationality, I don't care. Now, what I don't want you to do is bring home someone who may think it's okay to wear their pajamas out in public, keep their hair tied up out in public, or cursing in general. Now, that's just me. Some of you may think it's okay. We see it all the time. People wear their pajamas in public and they think it's okay. People wear their hair tied up. If it's not for medical reasons, it's not for religious or tribal beliefs, I just don't think your hair should be tied up while you're in public. I don't think you should have a bonded on while you're in public. I think you should take the time to comb your hair. And this is my hair. I get inbox messages. Is that your hair? Yes. Colored by Jackie McCullough. Is that Jackie's last name? And cut by Nisa McDonald Watkins. So yes, this is my hair. Don't inbox and ask me about, is this my hair? Yes, this is my hair. So that's kind of our pet peeves and our, our I'm just saying group of women were talking at work about what not to bring home. Don't take offense to it. You probably just may not be that one needs to come home, my boys. They're not that big of a catch. They are to me, but maybe not to you. So that's two minutes or less with Travis. Don't be too upset with me. Right. The truth should be welcome.